It's not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, the subscribe button, all that YouTube album stuff, so you get the videos I put them out. So you don't think and see them analyzing that data, like I tell every day. The day they release us is false, and then it gives us false, a false narrative of the market, so we can make bad trade decisions. Listen, one thing I've learned over the last 30 months is that the, the AMC, the GME, the retail community is very diverse. We have people that come from every single background, nationally and internationally, who have took their hard-earned money and invested into the stock. And a lot of times, <laughs> uh, retail investors can come up with, with, with ideas that, that I think are really, really crazy. And sometimes they, they come up with, with, with things that I find hilarious, but which makes sense also. You have a guy, his name is Stephen Hagenbuck, and... I might be ex uh, pronouncing his name wrong. If I did, forgive me. But you know what he said? He said, would the SEC allow AMC to sell synthetic seats? <laughs> I thought that was absolutely hilarious. But but it made it made sense to me. It made sense to me. Would the SEC allow AMC to sell synthetic seats? And then fail to deliver the seats to the movie patrons. Huh? Imagine you show up for the movie theater and they go, no, your seat is not available. It has not been delivered yet. Please come back next week and hopefully we will have the seat for you. If we don't have your seat in 13 trading days, we will put it on the, on the, the no AMC seat threshold list and then... <laughs> And then hopefully we will find a seat for you. If we don't find a seat in 13 days, come check with us again in 34 days to see if we found your seat. Now, it sounds hilarious, but when you compare it to what they're doing with AMC stock, it's exactly, th it's exactly true. In no other industry would this type of malfeasance, this type of nonsense be allowed. Imagine fair to deliver the AMC seats and telling people to check back in 13 days, check back in 30 days. We're going to put it on a list and let you know if seats are available. It's absolutely crazy. I thought it was funny as hell, but I think it is on point. Anyway, leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think any other industry would allow fair to deliver of their goods and services? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.